the purpose of this view is to quickly see how you can see uh, production orders through a calendar view, which is a standard feature in Odoo. Go to ma uh, manufacturing orders, you'll be presented with a list of your manufacturing orders with the deadline start date or the expected start date. Here, all you do is you go over here to your different views and you'll see them all. I can see things in a Kanban view, I can see things in a calendar view. And here it will show based on the time on a weekly calendar. If I look at monthly, I can see all the production orders per each day. Um, and obviously I can drill down into those production orders right from the calendar view uh, and begin working on them. So that is how you can see production orders from uh, a calendar view, right? I can see by day, which there are none today, or I can navigate through to the second and see those here, both scheduled for the same time. Um, I can see by week or I can see by month and you'll see everything laid out here. Um, it's in a lot of ways similar to my own Odoo environment. When I look at next activities, um, for example, a lot of things can be viewed, right? If I look uh, through the calendar view. So if I go to my pipeline and if I look here, calendar view, and if I look by month, it's going to show all my activities that I have to work on each day. And I can just, you know, click right in and it'll actually take me to those, those activities right behind it. So you get the idea. Um, the calendar view is a really nice feature. It can work across any model in Odoo or any app, any record type, right? I could look at orders if I wanted to. Um, I'm not going to do it in there, but I'm going to go to this environment and I can look at orders and you'll see this will also have a calendar view and it will show me in this case, just orders, or I believe, yeah, these are orders by uh, by date. And it's, again, I just created this environment today for the demo, but you see that you'll see all those orders listed here with the confirmation date specified. Um, you can also look at, for example, go to quotations and look at that through the calendar view, which we're gonna have a few more. And we can do a filter. Um, I wanna see order date just uh, this week or just today. And these are all going to be today, again, on the third, because that's when I created it. So probably not the best example, but you get the idea. It's um, all filterable based on these, and it'll present it through the lens of the calendar view. If you have any additional questions, feel free to reach out and let me know, and I'll be happy to help.